Hello and welcome to a oddly familiar uh, hospital with me, your hospital administrator, Dr. Peck. Um, and the reason we're experiencing some strange deja vu here is because it is the first level all over again. Uh, after a hiatus of sorts, uh, those of you who are on the edge of, edge of your seats wondering about my absence and where I have been, um, first of all, sit back, you'll do yourself a mischief. And second of all, I've encountered some technical problems. Uh, when I first did my last video, it all went pear shaped. But I fixed that issue, but then the PC itself broke and had this uh, rather, uh, yeah, I couldn't turn it on without hot wiring it, which seemed kind of dangerous. It felt a little bit illegal. Um, not that it was legal, uh, you understand, uh, we just felt it. So I've had to get a new laptop and I thought I was being clever by copying all the, all the files over from one laptop to the other because I could still turn it on, my old laptop, but I didn't include the save files. So here I am with this beautifully run, um, if I might say so, well it is because there's no patients at the moment, this rather well run and very nice looking hospital. Uh, it's missing a psychiatric department in the moment because I couldn't, I couldn't hire one. Oh, here we go. He'll do. Where is it? Psychiatric. And there's a space there just ready for him. So what I thought I'd do is I would not subject you through to an, another, was it, 30 odd videos of me bumbling about building hospital after hospital. No, I'm not that cool. I'd be awful goes against um, European Court of Human Rights, that kind of stuff. What I thought I would do with this video is to show you how to cheat. <laughs> if you don't know how to cheat in Theme Hospital, I don't know where you were for the entirety of the 90s. That's the kind of thing that you yeah, had to know. Um, I remember you got a game, you played it for a bit, and then you found out cheats for it, and then you used it, and then it kind of ruined the gaming experience. So, if you're honest, you then went back to just playing the game. Anyway, the same cheats from the original theme hospital are in the... Uh, are in, the, in this version. So what you do is you wait for a fax to come in. And then in the fax machine, you type into, into the fax machine 24328. I hope I'm doing this right, I'm doing it, doing it through memory. And then you come up with a cheat menu. And uh, here we go. It's a lot more uh, functional. It's a lot more easier to navigate than the original one. Uh, theme Hospital, if I remember it, in the original you had to press Shift and F1 to get money and Shift and F3 to get um, uh, emergencies and Control and M to the end of the month. Now it's all a nice little menu for you. And um, including new ones like Create a VIP or Create an Earthquake. Although, I did find this out when I was doing a test run. If you do click on Create an Earthquake on a level uh, that doesn't allow earthquakes, you get this rather terse message. Can it use this cheat on this level? You even fail to cheat. Not that funny, huh? Yeah, well... Yeah, whatever. But here we are. Uh, so we can add a bit of money. The hospital administrator is cheating. That brings back memories, that does. Um, all research cheating. That's no use in the first level. So you can do interesting things, like I can create a VIP. And there he is. The Mayor of Greater Trumpton, come on in. I don't think you can do more than one at a time, but you can create an emergency. Now these are things that, as far as I could tell, didn't work. Ooh, that's exciting. Um, yeah, they did have, apparently, controls to create emergencies and create patients, but in my experience they never worked in the original uh, game. And you can create a load of patients, but it's kind of hit and miss. So we should be seeing a horde of patients come through at some point. I just don't know when. Maybe it takes a month. Lawrence Nightingale can come in as well. I didn't cheat that one. Oh, here they are. Blimey. Well, that's a lot of fun. So you can have a bit of fun uh, with a cheat menu. I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't recommend it, you know, just playing the game. 
Normally it takes a lot of the challenge out, and without the challenge the game becomes less fun. Or so, you know, Goody Two Shoes tried to tell you. I had a lot of fun as a child, cheating in games. Especially Age of Empires 2, do you remember the cheat code? How do you turn this thing on? And you got like a, a fast car that like fired bullets. I got through so many campaigns. Um, I actually, I actually in, reinstalled uh, Age of Empires 2 recently, about a year ago, and I did the campaigns. I did the Geng Genghis Khan campaign. And I thought to myself, this is hard. How did I manage this as a child? And then I remembered, I just cheated my way through it. So, there we go. That's a lot of patience. Um, yeah, this is quite fun. <laughs> the, ooh, lovely. 90% chance. I should have. Um, I should just let him cure, cure him for 90% chance. But I wasn't paying attention because I was too busy about thinking about what to say. So this is the first time I've looked at the cheat menu, well second time, I did a test run about a month ago. Um, still it's all quite exciting, I've managed to completely ruin this uh, this level. But, the main point I'm getting to in this, uh, if there is a main point, is that I can continue, can continue from where I left off. I'll go to the level after the one that the uh, last one was on. Is it level 8 or something? I can't even remember, it's been so long ago. But what I can do is just continue to win the level, because you can press that button there. And uh, lo and behold, I've won the level. But you don't get bonus points. So I could do that, but I thought I'd take this opportunity with you know, the moving of the save file, you know, moving it from one PC to the other, and the hemorrhaging of save files in the meantime, to go on a hiatus with... Um, Theme Hospital. Oh, they brought us another patch, by the way. Um, it's 0 0.21 now. I think it's fixed some things, but, you know, I, I don't know. Oh, Staff Happiness. I think they've tweaked that a little bit. So, there's that. But, uh, I say, I say, as I say, I could go to where I, where I got to before the game failed. But I wouldn't have a very good score, because I'd, I'd have to cheat my way through. Or I could do the levels manually, but that's take hours. And, you know, I love you guys, but I can't devote that much time to it. So I figured what I'd, I'll do is I'll go on hiatus for a time. Well, hiatus on Theme Hospital. And I'll return to that at some point in the future. Uh, for the time being, I might look uh, towards some other games. Unless, of course, there's like overwhelming demand to see me you know, fumble through yet another hospital. In which case, I'll reconsider. So with that little nifty little trick um, revealed, I guess. Ugh, that looks horrible, that hospital. I'll um, I'll just leave you watching uh, patients throwing up, I suppose. And I will see you later. And uh, stay tuned for more. See you later, guys.